guys see that one? Again, this is Nate here to do a little uh, self scolding or maybe self encouragement, self analysis, uh, maybe a combination. I left in most of a session a multi ball drill that is fairly simple. Matt is just feeding me an out wide ball with underspin that I'm expected to step around and hit with a forehand rather than hitting with my backhand. Uh, sometimes I hit it great, uh, but when I don't hit it great, there are a couple of reasons why. Uh, one of those two reasons is when I'm sh when I'm shuffle stepping to the left, one, I'm doing that rather slow, and two, because I'm doing that rather slow, I'll hit the ball late and I'll hit it off balance, sending most of my energy off to my left. And I'm so I'm no longer on my toes and I'm no longer hitting the ball forward. I lose a lot of power that way. And that's the reason why some of these balls, even though they're going over, are going over very slowly. Another consequence of hitting the ball so late is that by the time I've started my arm swing, the ball is almost past me. I contact the ball with basically a straight arm before my elbow and wrist have the ability to uh, whip around and generate that extra speed. So I'm working just as hard to try and swing my arm forward, but I'm not benefiting from the other two mechanical you know, levers in my arm. So for next time, what I need to do is move faster, move farther so that I have enough space to make the swing, contact the ball early or earlier, and maybe try uh, planting my left foot further forward uh, so that I can keep my weight on my toes on after the weight transfer. And that's all I got. I'll see you guys next time.